ಜಯ ಜಯ ಶ್ರೀ ಸುದರ್ಶನ ಅಗರ ಮೊದಲ ಎಲ್ಲ ಆದಿ ಭಗವನ್ ಮುದಟ್ರೇ ಉಲಗ ಸೊ ಎಲ್ಲಾರ್ಕು ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ನಮಗೆ ಸಂಪ್ರದಾಯ ಮಂಜರಿ ಈ ಪಾಠಶಾಲ ಓಡ ತಮಿಳ್ ಲೆವೆಲ್ ಜೀರೋ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಲರ್ಕು ಮೊದಲ ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡಕ್ಷನ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಪಾತು ವಿ ಹವ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟೆಡ್ ವಿತ್ ವೈ ವಿ ಲರ್ನಿಂಗ್ ದ ತಮಿಳ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ಫಾಲೋಡ್ ಬೈ ದ ಕ್ಯಾಟಗರಿ ಆಫ್ ಲೆಟರ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ತಮಿಳ್ ಲ್ಯಾಂಗ್ವೇಜ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಇನ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ವವಲ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕಾನ್ಸನೆಂಟ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ವೇ ಸ್ವರಾಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ವ್ಯಂಜನಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಸಂಸ್ಕೃತ as well as in kannada and any indian languages we have the same category so coming to tamil we call vowels as uirayut adi en repeat vowel abina tamil la uirayut we, we call it as uirayut so slowly we move from calling the letter or alphabet as vowels to uirut so that's how you will able to progress in that language okay so you have to uh, start remembering this word uirut meyut in consonants to start with we are seeing the letters of uirut means the alphabet which, which will come under uirut this is last year, class recap we have two different categories two major categories of letters mudalayuttukal sarbayuttukal dependent letters independent letters independent letters means mudala yuttukal which will not depend on any other alphabet either uh, the structure or the sound no it has its own structure means its own stroke and its own sound the phonetic sound okay that is called as mudalayuttukal sarb in general sarb means dependent in tamil sarb sarnd irpad so it's dependent which means that alphabet either inherit the structure of other alphabet or the sound abina and the yelth and the letter and the alphabet and vera or alphabet madri irkalam illati vera or alphabet or letter okay and the vera or yelth oda sound in the letter la irkum irkum okay yeah so either sound or structure ida base panni this letter will be will be writing or pronouncing that's why this is called sarb yeth sarb sarnd means dependent so as the name suggests this is dependent means other category will be independent adula da we are seeing uirth meyeth we are into uirth adula rendu category irukku based on the sound inga capital small letter abinu neenga solra maadhiri adu structure base panni irukku ana in tamil the letters are categorized based on sound உயிரெழுத்து அப்படிங்கிறது சவுண்ட பேஸ் பண்ணி திருப்பி ரெண்டா பிரிச்சிருக்கா 
குரில் நெரில் குரில் அப்படின்னா குறுகிய ஓசை அப்படின்னா நெடில் வந்து டூ டேப் சவுண்ட் வரைக்கும் அந்த லெட்டரோட வாஸ கேக்கும் த சவுண்ட் கேன் பி ஹர்ட் அப் டு டூ டேப் சவுண்ட் மீன்ஸ் திஸ் இஸ் ஒன் அப்படினா இது அப்படின ரெண்டு டைம் கேக்கும் சோ அவ்ளோ அவ்ளோ நீண்ட அதோட ஒலி இருக்கும் ஒலினா சவுண்ட் ஓசை அ இ ஒ எ ஓ இதெல்லாம் குறுகிய ஓசை ஜஸ்ட் ஒன் டேப் சவுண்ட் இதுல எதுவும் பாத்துருக்கோம்னா இது வரைக்கும் கம்ப்ளீட்டட் அண்டர் திஸ் குரில் வி ஹாவ் கம்ப்ளீட்டட் அது வரைக்கும் முடிச்சிருக்கோம் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு சீ தர் டூ லெட்டர்ஸ் நெடில் அப்படின்னா லாங் சவுண்ட் ஓவல் ஆ இது வரைக்கும் முடிச்சிருக்கோம் பிபி சிங் த அதர் லெட்டர்ஸ் டுடே ஏ ஐ ஓ ஔ அப்படின்னா லாங் சவுண்ட் ஓவர் இதோட ஓ சவுண்ட் இட் வில் வில் பி ஹர்ட் இஸ் டூ டேப் சவுண்ட் அவ்வளோ நீண்டு கேக்கும் ஓகே so any doubt till here shall i and proceed to what we have seen till last class so if you have any doubt you can put it in the chat below so i hope it is clear till here so what else we have seen in the first few classes is the count vowel var uyirathukal or 12 in numbers மெய் எழுத்துக்கள் ஆர் எயிட்டீன் இன் நம்பர்ஸ் ஓகே மெய் எழுத்துக்கள் லோலி யூ வில் பி ஏபிள் டு ரீட் அஸ் வி கம்ப்ளீட் த லெட்டர்ஸ் உயிர் மெய் எழுத்துக்கள் கான்சனன்டல் வவர் அப்படிங்கிறது தட்ஸ் வாட் ஐ சைட் நோ டிபெண்ட் லெட்டர் மீன்ஸ் இட் எதர் இன்ஹெரிட் த ஸ்ட்ரக்சர் ஆர் த சவுண்ட் ரைட் ஸோ தட் இஸ் உயிர் மெய் எழுத்துக்கள் தீஸ் ஆர் த பேசிக் count uh, i mean uh, categories and the count of respective categories okay this is what we started with a a e e u u u here we have completed in two sections so the top row is completed till last okay this class will be starting with a okay so a so the sound of a is similar to the sound of a in animal so the red color denotes in that word is the sound how you pronounce in that particular english word okay here uh, the red color that is being given below this is transliteration the red color in the transliteration denotes how you write uh, uh, the transliteration of particular letter here you have to know because uh, in tamil we have specific uh, letter for a in singular but in english we just have capital letter and small letters so with that as input what we are doing in tamil is whenever there is a kuril short sound it will be represented using small letters uh, this is the first time 
Arian is mentioning about this. So please take a note. This will help you to read transliteration of any Tamil word or sentence. Okay. In Tamil, the short sound letters are denoted by small letter. Kuril. Kuril letter. Adalame. Small letter. Lada Yerdua. If you see here, N mm, is alone. Can. So, Amma, A, Nedil, Mind was a irka. So, A, we have written A in capital. It means long sound. It means uh, Amma, A. Okay. So, this is a note I would like to mention in this class. Okay. Here, yeah. A. Ah. So, Assess the sound in arm. Okay, arm. E, e is like ink, ink, it. So that e, a, a, e. Kuril. Okay. So these are few words we have discussed. The sound of E is, please note, it is capital I, uh, equal sound uh, of this particular, I is the transliteration, in the bracket is how you pronounce this particular Tamil letter, okay, steel, e, how you pronounce, e, w, e, how you pronounce, in the same way you have to pronounce this letter, okay. So this one is transliteration, equal transliteration of Tamil E, okay? The bracket is the sound of this particular letter. Uh, the structure of this entire PPT will be, okay? So again, coming to next. O sound, okay? U is small u, double, how you say, ud, how you pronounce double, w, o, o, d, in that only w, o, how you pronounce that w, o, the same way you have to pronounce this letter, ud, ulf, okay, ud, ulf. Now, coming to O. O sound is capital U. So here, uh, again, uh, just to mention that uh, 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 the phonetic sound in bracket in transliteration. Okay. Capital U is the transliteration of O. So in in capital. However, the sound of O is W W O O O. How you say oof? Oofer. You say oot. Okay. This is the way you will be pronouncing O sound. How you pronounce this W O O sound in the word oof? The same way this O sound has to be capital use the transliteration. So till here we completed. Today we will be moving to A sound. A. The sound or uh, the transliteration of A is small e. The transliteration of A is small e. Okay. Now we'll see the sound. A. As such in elephant. How you pronounce E in elephant. So 
the transliteration is small e the sound of this a is how you say e in the word elephant elephant that's how you say no the a example a example right so that's a short sound okay this is for the understanding since you all know english uh, that's been a common language across the world for communication so uh, we are using learning the particular sound or uh, you know the word through english this is for only few classes once we complete all alphabets of all tamil and then moving to direct tamil words no transliteration will be used okay so a a this is kuril a a you see the words a eli a eli not the transliteration which is small e a eli a the meaning is given in the bracket rat for rat in tamil it is eli eli now number 8 in tamil is ettu 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 it so many years okay we'll see about that later ettu ettu a one more word bull means erudu in tamil we say bull as erudu a erudu so adian will repeat once you all please repeat one or one or twice on the twice in mute with me a eli a eli a eli a ettu a ettu a ettu a erudu a erudu erudu any doubt okay eli ettu a erudu now first in a a yelthu yelthukal i've written right yelthu means letter n n number yellai a yellai yellai means border a yadai yadai means weight a yelumichai 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 illa yelumichai yelumichai means lemon okay vegetable lemon so a yelthu a n ye yellai ye yadai ye yelumichai okay coming to sampradayam words since this is this tamil we are learning under sampradayam jari ee paatshala will be seen some more words which is frequently used sampradayam okay ye yelundaruludal perumal eliyasha abdin kekkaram illaya adu vandu 
எழுந்தருளுதல் to visit or to come எஞ்சியது எஞ்சியது அப்படிங்கிறது தான் ப்ராப்பர் சம்பிரதாய சொல் லெஃப்ட் ஓவர் மீந்தது அப்படின்னு அப்படின்னு சொல்லுவோம் இல்லையா இந்த லெஃப்ட் ஓவர் அதை எஞ்சியது எம்பெருமான் லார்ட் விஷ்ணு எம்பெருமானார் எதிராசன் ஸ்ரீபேஷைக்காரர் ராமானுஷர் எதேச்சை அதான் கஸ்மாதா ஆக்சிடென்ட்லி ஐ மெட் ஹர் டெம்பிள் அப்படின்னு சொல்லுவோம்ல எதேச்சியா பார்த்தேன் அப்படின்னு சொல்லுவோம்ல அது யா இல்ல ஏ எதேச்சை okay so these are some sampradayam words now we'll see how to write this letter a i hope the screen is visible so i'll write write this basic stroke so a small circle with a little curve and a sleeping line followed by a standing line this is a in english this english transliteration this is a okay this is short short sound that is kuril okay kuril followed by a small curve a sleeping line standing line a a a a a any doubt in this writing you can message in chat window if you all done you can message in chat window yes or no so that i can wait before i move to next letter no okay you want to write i'll write or not yeah you write this let write entire ppt that will be shared in the group okay just write this letter alone a yeah. done okay so we'll go to next letter we go to next letter okay <laughs> long sound so capital e a let's see how to pronounce that using no english as such we pronounce the letter a in the word agent the sound of this a is similar to the sound of a let alphabet a pronounced in the word agent agent that's how we pronounce area area agent right so the sound will pronounce agent area the same way a the sound of this eighth a is a long vowel okay we see some words using this a a n i a a n i there is a mistake in transliteration uh, 
should be capping. So A, B, if our focus is on A alone, this N should be capital. A, B means ladder. A, B, seven. In Tamil, it is A, B. If I pronounce this word instead of A, I say A. A, B, A, B means wake up okay you know you in the if you say get up or wake up okay say say yeah yeah you means number seven so i say you means wake up so this is why you have to learn tamil properly okay you cannot simply learn or read Tamil in transliteration unless you know the proper or not transliteration of particular words or letters you cannot read it properly because see if it is needle it is number seven kuril just you will wake up okay so this is the purpose we are learning Tamil okay again so ye do means book uh, older way we have that manuscript and all ye do okay so that one is called ye do you can see or you can make cut from the picture itself ye do these are called ye do If I say Yedu, Yedu means take. Other Yedu, take the. Okay. If I say Yedu means take. If I say Yedu means book. This is the difference. So, pronounce it correctly. See the letter, which is Ye or Ye, and pronounce the way it has to be pronounced. So, Aryan will repeat once or twice. You also repeat along with Aryan in mute. Ye ni. Ye ni. Ye ni. Ye ru. Ye ru. Ye du. Ye du. Ye do. Okay. This is some more words. So don't feel that you are getting bored. Uh, this is very important. The more focus for basic letters and basic uh, pronunciation, the more uh, you will become, you know, uh, expert in reading Tamil. Okay. So this will be very slow. Again, want the basic should be as strong as possible. Okay, so the more words you hear, your vocabulary, vocabulary will be improved. Okay, this is helping you in many forms. The sampradaya words. So when you hear some sampradaya words in any upanyasam or any any pasram, you will able to make out the meaning. So don't just take this is just as a slide. Don't take take this as a slide. This is uh I know this is giving you more in, input about the language. Okay? So listen carefully. Uh, we are going very slow, but this is very important because the pronunciation is what matters in Tamil or in any language. In Sanskrit also first ta, second ta, third ta, so this has to be very proper, right? Mahapranas should be pronounced properly. The same way Tamil, Nedil, Kuril has to be pronounced properly. Okay? Yeri. Coming to this. Yeri. Yeri. Lake. Yelakai. 
ஏலக்காய் ஏலக்காய் ஏழை உப்போ ஏராளம் மெனி ஏராளம் மெனி ஏரி ஏலக்காய் காரணமும் ஏழை ஏராளம் மெனி ஏராளமா இருக்கு அப்படின்னு சொல்வாள் இல்லையா ஏகாந்தம் ஏகாந்த சேவை அப்படின்னு பெருமாளுக்கெல்லாம் நடக்கும் கோவில் இல்லையா ஏகாந்தம் அப்படின்னா லோன்லி ஓகே பெருமாள் மட்டும் தனியா அப்படின்னு சொல்ற மாதிரி ஏகாந்த சேவை அப்படின்னு ரொம்ப அமைதியா இருக்கணும் ஏன்னா அது ரொம்ப ஏகாந்தமா பெருமாள் மட்டும் இருக்கிற மாதிரி ஒரு சேவை இல்லையா சோ ஏகாந்தம் அப்படின்னா லோன்லினஸ் ஏகாதசி ஏகாதசி எல்லாருக்குமே தெரியும் ஓகே ஏகாந்தம் ஏகாதசி ஓகே சரி Uh, take a look of how to write this. A. B. N. S. writing in different color. So, A. The transliteration is capital E. This is Nedil. Nedil means in Tamil we should be writing this way. Okay, this is Nedil. Right? Same. Just write A. The same word. A letter. but down a slanting line okay abhi end rakhi so first write a okay below that you put a slanting right line a you put a slanting line below a it will become a okay a one more time Again, because using mouse, it's going here and there. This is correct. Perfect. This is correct. Yay! Done. You all have written. is okay good so understood a this is a a a okay okay thank you adian will move to uh, so we'll see two more letter i'm taking some extra 5 minutes 5 minutes minutes so I ye yeah, i interestingly as one 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 interesting point over here so ye yeah, followed by capital i why capital i because it's nedil this is transliteration itself ye yeah, followed by i capital i this is the transliteration of i this is the transliteration of i how it is pronounced i'll i'll you say no in english and not i'll like i'll na the uh, in the row right okay i'll the same i i so that i you will be stressing more right uh, this sound will be heard longer it means only short if i say eyes eyes i so this is how you have to understand ye followed by capital i is the transliteration we'll see some more words 
ஒன் usually panja pandavas uh, we say no in tamil we call them as aivar panja mean five right panja pandavas in tamil we name them as aivar this is very common term aivar means panja pandavas only okay pandavas are five in number and sir aivar aivar airavatam the elephant of indra airavatam so a i r a capital a so middle airavatam the i is capital here okay airavatam aind ai aind ai aind ai airavatam ai airavatam ai aivar ai aivar okay we will see how to write ai Okay, I will return the letter by I small a followed by capital I. Is the transliteration? This is middle. Write I over here. I will write over here. Okay. First, write the basic stroke. Okay, and followed by one more mountain stroke. bring down can you write till here so please write till here the basic stroke followed by one more mountain bring till here again write writing followed by a mountain bring that the curve should be parallel you all done till here now write like a w i isn't it easy bring the curve down write like a w that's all it has to be connected well okay the curve should be connected well i got it I done. Isn't it easy, no? Okay. I'll write one more time. Okay. Basic stroke. We'll write in one go. Followed by one more mountain. Bring down. Now one go. See oh, this one. Followed by like a W. I. done i 
so because we have split at top and bottom this is not uh, no looks very well connected but this how it should be right okay that's okay for easy understanding easy writing we do it it's okay write one more time and yes you come please i done okay right see easy no right so i will write all three letters in one time one go you also please write these are the letters we learned to today a first letter is a eli a yerd a a done ett a yer edu eri eri is also that not eri we are seeing for a eri eri dal okay e eli second letter is same way cut a slanting line down a eri e ni ye ye lakai ye ka dasi ye ka dasi e ye ni ye yu ye lu lu means uh, a special letter in tamil ye lu number 7 ai ai ndu ai ai ndu ai ai va ai am okay so we'll see some more letters uh, some more words in i okay i am i am means offering okay we have different meanings but we have taken this meaning i am one mixture of five metals i am one i am one silai abina is very common term i am one silai aishwaryam wealth i am body five senses i am body ஐந்து புலன்கள் அப்படின்னு சொல்லுவோம் இல்லையா ஐம் பொறி ஐம் அப்படின்னாலே ஃபைவ் ஐந்து அப்படிங்கிறத அப்படின்னு இந்த சேர்த்து எழுதுவோம் ஐம் பொன் ஐந்து விதமான பொன் அப்படின்னா மெட்டல்ஸ் சம்பிரதாய வேர்ட்ஸ் ஐதீகம் ஒன்ஸ் ஐதீகம் என்ன அப்படின்னு சொல்லுவாங்க பிலீஃப் ஐதீகம் ஐயப்பாடு ஐயப்பாடு மீன்ஸ் ஃபியர் ஆர் டவுட் ஓகே ஐயப்பாடு ஃபியர் ஆர் டவுட் ஓகே ஐவகை ஐவகை புஷ்பம் அப்படின்னு சொல்லுவாள் இல்லையா ஐந்து வகை ஐ அப்படின்னாலே ஐந்து அப்படிங்கறத குறிக்கு ஐவகை அப்படின்னா ஐந்து வகை ஃபைவ் டைப் ஓகே So we have seen how to write this letter i okay so uh this o o au o o au these letters we we'll see in next class because it is getting late uh since i am gave a revision from us so next class we'll see these followed by um, a small comparison between tamil and sanskritam okay and then a uh, tirukkural so next class it will be o o au uh, followed by comparison and then 
Okay. So this again ending today's class. Danyasmi, Jayashri, Sudarshana.